the Toronto Raptors teamed up with the city's Transportation Commission to showcase Indigenous athletes from across the country. Tamara Pimentel has that story. Anishinaabe basketball player Emily Mandamin is one of eight athletes being featured in the campaign, which celebrates Indigenous athletes in Canada. From the Iskatewazagigan First Nation in northwestern Ontario, Mandamin is enrolled with the Manitoba Bisons basketball program. At a young age, there's not a lot of representation to look up to. Um, personally, that's something that I struggled with. Finding somebody that I could relate to and finding somebody that I could talk to or look to for guidance. And so I think that's kind of been the message I've been trying to convey as, as well as other athletes at a high level, um, trying to show that we are here and playing high level basketball and high level sports is a thing for us. The Raptors partnered with the Toronto Transportation Commission for the campaign. Buses and streetcars throughout the city show photos of Indigenous athletes making history in Canada. Well, that's been our whole goal so far is telling our stories and talking about the things that we had to go through in order to find our place within sport and wellness. Sport can be a way of medicine and can be a way of life. Oftentimes in Indigenous communities, we find ourselves struggling with substance abuse, uh, mental health issues, poverty. I'm a product of that and I struggled a lot with my mental health at a young age, but I often found my way at the basketball court. You know, sport can be a happy avenue for us in our future. Tamara Pimentel, APTN National News, Winnipeg.